Hey my dolls and welcome back to my channel. So I figured out that ever since I bleached my hair, I haven't done any makeup tutorial for you guys. So here it is, my favorite nude makeup for platinum or blondies or just anybody. Yeah, anybody can rock this look. So as per usual, I'm just going to first, first of all start out by filling in my brows. And I am going in with the Rimmel Brow Pencil in dark brown. Now this brings me to something that I have learned ever since I bleached my hair. If you know me, I love my brows pretty, pretty dark, but I just discovered that dark brows do not go with platinum hair. Like, you just look so funny. So I've learned to, or I've learned to make my brows a little bit lighter than you know it used to, and yeah, it's good. So to clean up my brows, I'm going in with the NARS concealer in caramel. I'm just going to use that on the bottom part of my brow. For the top part of my brow, I'm going to use my foundation. Now, if you also noticed, I had to tie a scarf around my head before I take my makeup. And that's because if you have blonde hair and apply makeup, most times makeup, the foundation will tend to stain your hairline. So tying a scarf is always very, very helpful. You guys, I struggled for like weeks, for like two weeks. I was like, how do I apply foundation without getting my hairline messed up? So I learned to just tie a scarf around it. And then after I'm done, I go in with a very small brush to blend out my hairline area. So if you're a blondie or you have platinum hair and you've been struggling with this, always tie a scarf before going in with your makeup. So now I'm using the same concealer on my eyelid just to make sure that the whole area is uniform and just one color. Now for my face, I'm going with my favorite foundation and that's the Fenty Beauty in 370 and 390. And yeah, I know you're wondering like, girl, isn't that too light? The thing is, my hands and my face are the darkest part of my body. So my face is obviously darker than my neck. So I blend to my neck and my chest and that's what works for me. So after I'm done using a brush, I always like to go in with a sponge to make sure I remove all the excess foundation and also make sure the product is pushed into my skin. Now to highlight, um, I'm going in with the Fenty Stick in, I think this is Caramel. So I'm contouring my face now with the Matchstick Trio in Truffle. So right now I'm blending out all the contoured areas and I'm, next I'm just setting my skin face with the makeup revolution banner powder after which i'm going with the cover girl ebony bronzer now ever since i bleached my hair i have been loving my makeup on the warmer side like there's something about your face being warm sun kissed or and then you have blonde hair like i don't know i think because maybe the hair draws a lot of attention to your face so you need your face to be really warm bronzy and contoured just to balance everything out so right now i'm going in with the bobby brown highlighter in bronze glow i love this stuff my face my skin is really really textured but this highlighter highlighter doesn't make my texture you know too pronounced so i'm just going in with some blush and it's just everything just going to you know make my face really look warm and now i'm just going to pop on some lashes because i don't know girl if you don't wear lashes you're in long thing girl i love my lashes they just make any look look like a look is a look <laughs> so to blend my lash line i'm just going in with a black pencil and then i'm just going to top my highlight with a little bit of the rum stick. This step is really, really not necessary, but that's just me being too extra. And I'm setting my face with MAC Fix Plus. For my lip combination, I used, oh, okay. 
now right now i have taken off my scarf i'm just blend in i'm blending the excess foundation i have just to match my hairline now for my lip combination i went in with the same stick that i used to contour and highlight truffle on the outer part of my lip and then caramel on the inner part and you guys looking at it you know you think i have lipstick on but no it's my contour stick and yes girl that's the look now um most times if i don't wear this look i just go in with my normal lip gloss and call it a day like that's it and yeah that's it it's a look nude look i hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to leave a sweet comment down below leave a huge like subscribe hit that notification bell and i'll see you all in my next one bye guys